All of my YouTubians, K-Pasa, how's it going? Katie here. So in this video, I'm going to tell you things that happened today that kind of drove me insane. And by kind of, I mean like a lot. Okay. So I guess we can start off with the fact that it was raining and I don't like rain. I've never liked rain. It's not because it's like wet, I guess. It's just because, you know, whenever it's rainy, it's all like dark and gloomy and cloudy and that just makes me really upset. I've always hated rain. It's just dark and dark and I don't like it and it doesn't help that you get wet but anyway so I had a test today in my first hour which is history so you know after walking in the rain to my class um I sit the front row of my history class and I sit right in front of the teacher like there's the teacher's desk and then here's a row of desks and then here's me and so we're taking this test right my teacher thinks it's a good idea to sit there on her computer and type a book. I don't know what she was typing, I don't know why she was typing, but this lady would not stop typing. I mean, it was insane, like, the amount of words that, one, she was typing, and two, that she never stopped typing. She just kept going, and what is this piece of hair doing? It's driving me insane. Um, she just kept typing. And I wanted to take her computer and throw it at the wall. I wanted to pick it up and maybe, like, throw it out the window of the second story building. Because, lady, you need to not be typing when I sit right in front of you and I'm trying to take a test. If you want me to be all quiet in this and take this test, then, lady, you need to be quiet, too, so that we can concentrate on this test. Because I have the attention span of a peanut, and if you're going to be typing, and then not typing, and then typing some more, and then not typing, and then typing some more, I'm going to lose my mind. And I basically was losing my mind, and it took me twice as long to take this test, because this lady would not stop typing. Like, you need to be quiet while I'm trying to take this test. Okay, lady? Thanks. Because you're dumb, and I'm mad at you. Because you wouldn't stop typing. And then not to mention, every time someone would turn in their test to the teacher, they wouldn't just wait for them to write their name, right? Wait, they would uh, They wouldn't wait for her to just write their name down and then leave. No, they would come up and be like, oh, I watched this TV show. Oh, I heard of this. Oh, I heard of that. Oh, the presidential election. And I'm like, can you not do that now? Like, can you not do that now? Thanks. People annoy me, everybody annoys me, and it was stupid. But I finally finished the test eventually, basically whenever the class was over because I took the whole time to take the test because I was so distracted. And then after that, I met up with one of my friends whose class was in the class next to mine, but like 30 minutes later, and um, we were sitting in the hallway uh, on one of these benches and there was this kid a few benches down laying out like completely on his stomach on one of these benches excuse me are you gonna take a sleep like what are you doing this is not your bed this is not your room what are you doing are you comfortable because that's a wooden bench it's not that comfortable are you gonna sleep what are you doing why are you doing that why i don't i don't understand you Also, I realized that I need to go get my brakes checked out because they were like squeaking and that annoys me. It annoys me because you like if you drive a car and your brakes start squeaking and like it makes the e noise and you're like, oh god, is that my car? Yeah, yeah, it was one of those moments and I was like, oh man checked out because it um, can't be having that and I got time for that so I have to get my brakes checked out and that makes me angry because I don't like it um um in math today we we did this one problem this this actually doesn't like make me mad but we were talking about imaginary numbers and using I and we did this one problem and I got it right and I was like so amazed because I haven't done any of my homework for like the past two chapters and we have a test on Thursday 
And for me to get this one problem right, I was amazed. And the girl that sits next to me is like, wow, did you really get it right? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I did. Like, look at me, knowing things once in math class. But, yeah, I have to go to work in a few, in like an hour actually. But that was just some things that drove me insane. My, com my, my teacher on that computer made me want to rip my face off. It was so annoying. Like, I have the attention span of a goldfish, and I probably didn't know half of the things that were on that test anyway. So, like, I needed to be able to look at all the options of these multiple choice questions and think about it, but it was hard to do that when this lady was typing. Ugh, I really did. Like, can I just, like, turn into the She-Hulk? Is that okay? Can I maybe be, like, purple instead of green? Things that people should turn into. She-Hulk. Alright, that's it for this video. Adios, my amigos. Bye!